Hey, what's up YouTube? Today we're going to be going over the 6 star legend runecraft event. I'm going to be giving a bit of advice and some general tips on what rune to pick. One of my viewers wanted some advice on this, so I'll be making this video. Hopefully I can help you guys out a little bit. But in general, I like to recommend going for the rune that you need the most. So depending if you need a slot 246, primarily I recommend those. You can also go for a 135 if you really need those, but I do recommend going for the 246 just because they can generally be used on more mons. I would say go for the 246. I also recommend going for the rune type that you need the most. Me personally, I really struggle with swift runes. So as you can see, I ended up going for a swift rune and I really lack fast slot 6 swift runes. So this is what I will be going for for one of them. As you can see, this isn't really necessarily a bad roll. We are one off of crit rate. And the thing is, we do have flat defense. So I'm going to be going for one with HP instead. Just in case when we roll it twice and we get the double speed. Two after that, if they go into HP, it won't be that bad. But hopefully, you know, we're all trying to go for the 30 speed. So this is what I like to do to see what kind of runes that I need. So I'll go to slot 6. I already knew that I needed this slot. But for example, I'd look through each rune type, each category. Look through your 246s, depending on the type of stats that you need as well. Not everyone needs speed. Some people need just stats in general. So check out the runes in that slot and compare them and see if you can potentially upgrade a rune in that slot. So I'm going to go for my slot 6 swift runes. Look through them really quickly. We have 16 speed, the fastest, 22, 26. That's going to be my fastest in this slot. We have a 25, another 25, another 26. We have a few 22s, but nothing over 26, as you can see. So I would like to upgrade that. It'd be very important. This is the only slot 6 attack swift rune that is 26 speed. I can, I believe I can maybe grind it one more to get 27. But I would like to get maybe to like 28, 29, 30 grinded, if not faster. This one is a slot 6 HP rune with 26 speed, but I'm looking for an upgrade for my Tiana. Another thing that I like to do is try to upgrade specific mons like my Tiana. This is the main reason why I'm going for the slot 6 with high speed on it. So I can upgrade my Tiana to make her better, faster, and that way I don't get outsped. And so I'm basically going to be speed chasing, which I don't really recommend here. I do recommend trying to go for overall stats in general. So like for example, this one is one that has pretty good substats. It can be used on a lot of different mons. I'm using it on my Eshir right now. It's a triple speed roll with some attack and defense and accuracy. Main stat, HP, not the best rolls as you can see, but it's still very usable and especially if it, it rolled higher with speed, then it'd be something to use. So I would recommend going for something similar to this, whatever you need. Sometimes you need crit rate. I know I struggled with crit rate, so that's something that I would work on as well. I really struggle with having slot 6 attack will runes with crit rate on it. As you can see, I have crit rate, but I just don't really have speed. So maybe that's something that I can upgrade as well. That's something that should be upgraded because this is a pretty much universal type rune. You can use it on things like Zyros all the way to things like Sierra. So the types of runes that I would recommend are Swift, Despair, Vile, and Will in any order. Whatever you lack, those are some of the most universal type of runes that you can use. You could even go for Rage Set because having a really good Lucian can help you out in PvP and PvE. One last tip I have for this event is to please be patient because if you were to just pick that rune and roll it, you might not get as good of a roll as if you would have just waited for the right stats. I do recommend going for the highest rolls on the stats if possible. But at the end of the day, I can only recommend these runes. You know your account better than I do. You know what you're missing. And I do recommend going for what you're missing, what you need, potential upgrades, or whatever you are lacking in. I didn't go too in-depth in this video because I know a lot of YouTubers have already made their rune advice videos. But I hope this video helped you guys a little bit. If it did, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Thank you, Dino, for the video suggestion. Hope it helped you out. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.